Does it slow the plant down if you think a few more still growing? No. It's gone. I like plants like that. It's gone, Gordon. It's the easiest plant in the world to grow. I'll we'll just roll it up the nine feet, guys. It's a really small one. Thanks, Gordon. Kind of close. These are Chinese artichokes. You can see that these are really, really, really prolific. You can eat them just, just like that. They are yummy. They are yummy. Really, really easy to grow. Um, they're of the mint family, so it gives you a clue. You, you, anybody can grow mint. Um, but they produce a massive tubers out of the one plant. And you can eat them raw once they're cleaned up. Um, they were introduced to Europe but didn't take off. The French started with them. Um, since the introduction of potatoes, they fell out of fashion. So, um, but this is one of my favourite root crops. This tastes unbelievable. Um, for the amount of effort involved in harvesting it, it's certainly worth it. They're a root crop that sort of makes you get into it. They're like a parsnip, they're of the carrot family. Um, so as a and they're replant mm -hmm. and divide perennial. And just die down this time I love them in the garden because they look like if anybody knows Queen Anne's lace. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. it just looks it's absolutely fungus. gorgeous. Yeah, mm -hmm. and it's, so it's really good from a, a garden point of view because they produce these beautiful flat little heads of flowers and all the pollinators love them and so it's good for attracting the beneficials to your garden. Mm -hmm. So it fulfills quite a few different uh, niches in a garden. They're fairly clean. You, just have to, you can dig them up and they'll last in the garden two, three, four, five years without doing this. Sometimes the roots, if it's very dry, they can go a bit, um, they get a hard core in the roots. The roots actually get bigger. This is only a first year plant. So eventually the roots get a little bit wider as far as flavour goes. Oh, what's it's the, super parsnip. It's super parsnip. They're yeah, super yeah, absolutely. They're, just, they're probably the, my favourite root vegetable of a lot. They just no, taste yeah. absolutely the diet. Um, and like we used to use them, they're a major staple of what for in Europe. Um, they were introduced to England, we think, by the Romans. But they were grown right through um, that area. But they're just because there's no commercial way you could commercial put that into a uh, a supermarket, you're never ever going to find it. So you've got to grow this at home.